Developing now video you got to see a man rushes through security at Sky Harbor plowing through several TSA officers. Yeah, tonight he's facing several charges and the union representing TSA says the airport needs better protection. Team Tall's Bianca Bono joins us now with the facts unfolding tonight. Bianca. Well, guys, the union president says they are not trained to physically defend themselves and travelers and want a stronger police presence at the airport. Security camera video showing a man barreling through airport security. When I saw the video, I was shocked. On Tuesday morning in Sky Harbor's Terminal 4, Tyrese Garner forcing his way through a security checkpoint. First, attacking a female TSA officer, knocking her to the ground, then punching four others. TSA employees ultimately tackling Garner. TSA Union President Juan Casares says police should have done that. We have no self-defense training or anything. These officers never went to an academy. Casares claims there aren't enough police officers working at the airport and believes something like this will happen again if that doesn't change. We don't carry a gun. We don't carry a mace. We don't carry a taser or anything like that. So we depend on PD. Casares, thankful the suspect wasn't armed, saying the situation could have been much worse. What if this perpetrator would have had something else? What would happen if he would have made it into the public? Casara says he's trying to set up a meeting with the mayor to express safety concerns. Now, as for the suspect who's from Texas, it's unclear why he charged security, but court documents say he was under the influence and may be mentally disturbed. Guys, back over to you. Developing.